workout. This is workout 241 and it is a hand weight workout once again. My workouts from now on pretty much are going to stick with either body weight or hand weights only because I've changed the workout uh, at the warehouse. Since we have a big group it's easier instead of doing stations and going from one piece of equipment to another we're just sticking with hand weights so we can all do it at the same time. So which is motivating, um, you know, it gets people try to keep up with the other person, um, so I think it works out well. So, you'll just need hand weights, but you will need different uh, weights of hand weights. So, varying weights, uh, lightest for your skull crushers, for your triceps. Mine are weaker, so I go with the lighter um, that I'm strengthening up uh, for the triceps muscle. Um, heavier, we're gonna do a goblet squat, so I want you to have a really heavy one, because we're gonna squat down and do a heel raise. Um, and of course, your bicep curls, and. We're doing a fly. So have a couple different weights handy. Make sure you have a, um, a warm up in before we get started. Now I did, um, and I apologize for not doing wor uh, videos for you. I ran, I biked and ran this morning with a friend um, and I thought I haven't done another workout. Uh, this was last night's workout. So um, I really wanted to get one in for you guys to do so that you don't give up on me and, <laughs> and think I'm not interested. I do want to keep on bringing you videos um, because I love your comments and I also want to help you stay fit and strong. I need the workout just as much too. Uh, doing the cardio stuff, the strength, um, the biking and running and swimming is great, but uh, strength work is and core work is very important also. So this is the workout for today. Using hand weights. Nothing too crazy. I left Jacks with Knee Cross on there because um, I'd say it, but some of the men struggle with this one. <laughs> so I figured the more we do it, maybe the more they'll get used to it. So it is a jumping jack. Go back out for the jumping jack and then bring a knee in. So jumping jack, jumping jack, knee in, jumping jack, jumping jack out and bring a knee in. Um, it's a little confusing, but I figured the more you do it, hopefully you get it. Okay, so 54 seconds of work. I'll bring that up. You know, two more seconds from when I did it last, Tuesday maybe. Uh, 54 seconds, 10 seconds of rest, 19 Tabatas. I'm going one time through for you because um, I did have breakfast and um, I just want to get a workout in. So it's not a, I don't want to go through the whole thing. So it is a 19 minute workout, 18 Tabatas, one cycle. So if you're doing it twice through, of course, when I'm switching, you'll stick with the same leg because there are a Romanian deadlift one leg, so you're going to come down and then halfway through I'll switch, but you stick stick with it. Okay, let's get started. Listening to iTunes radio again. So, Gorilla. Five seconds to prepare. Of course, our first one is our jacks with the cross knee. There we go. Jumping jacks and cross knee. So there isn't a whole bunch of cardio, uh, so I want you to get your heart rate up when we do the cardio. Okay, there's strength, of course, you'll get your heart rate up. But here, start jumping around, light on your feet. Jack, arms all the way up. Loosen up all those joints. I hope you had your warm up in so you are loose, but in case you cool down a little. So here we go. Jack and cross. And breathe this way. crunch here. And then we go to our single leg. Oh my goodness, 
Oh, guess who's going to have to do this one over again? I forgot. Do one. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. So we will have to do that one. So now grab your light weights. We're doing a skull crusher with scissor legs. So onto the floor. Feet up. Arms up. Skull crusher. Elbows are going to stay high. Every time the weights come down, one leg is coming down. You're not laying it down, you're lowering, just hovering over the floor. Elbows stay high, bring them on either side of your face, right to your ears, and press it up. Elbows stay high. Keep on emphasizing that, because I don't want you to point them out to the sides. They're staying up to the ceiling. Stomach is tight, lower that leg, so you're getting a little ab work, as well as tricep work. Breathe. That's the way, guys. Two. And then one. Rolling them up and stay. And drop one weight. So you want to stay with a lighter weight. We're doing a seated sidewinder. So this one you're going to sit. Elevate your legs. Weight comes out to the side. Bring it to the center and switch. So this takes a lot of strength in your core, your back. So if it bothers your back, you're gonna sit down and sit up higher. So adding the weight challenges you. So we can get out to the side. Breathe, balance. That's the way. enough to challenge you but light enough that you can actually bring it out to the side without moving your body around. You got it, five seconds. Two and one. Nice. Okay, so now you're staying down. We're doing a break dance. So high plank position. You're going to bring the leg underneath the body. Swoop. Onto your heels. One comes up. Open up and do the other side. So a lot of shoulder work here, holding yourself up on one arm. If this is too much for you, stay in high plank and just do a knee cross under, okay, until you can balance on that one arm and your heel. That's the way. Breathe. Bending my leg, weight on my leg, and opening up. Two, and one. Okay, now we're doing fast feet drop downs. So, 10 fast feet, drop down to your belly, and then come up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fast feet, drop all the way down, press up. Go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Drop and come up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Drop and come up. Come on, fast, fast, fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Keep those hips up high. 
and you can go heavier here. So challenge yourself. Breathe. Stomach is tight, squeezing your glutes. Down and up. That's the way. Come on. Stay up high. Lift those hips. Good job, guys. Okay, so now grab your heavy weight. I think I did a 20 at the warehouse yesterday. What is this one? This is a 30. Goodness, okay. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Squat, heel raise, and stand. Squat. So come on, challenge yourself. Yeah, it's heavy, but 54 seconds. Come on. Squat down, heel raise, and stand. Down, up, and stand. So the heavier weight is challenging you to squeeze. Raise yourself up. It's easy going down. It's hard Oof. going up. Down. Oof. That's the way, guys. Oof. A few more. Oof. Oh. Oof. Next time I'm going to look and see what my husband has out. Now we're doing a single leg burpee. So halfway through, we gotta switch. Okay, balance, squat down, jump out, push up, jump in, and jump up. Let's try to get five in. What we have to change? Two. your armpits and then whoosh, going down the hill whoosh, let's pick up our pace squatting back now forward so my sweat is flying with me as we're skiing whoosh, whoosh. that's right guys working the glutes and the triceps today nice job this, right? So excited. <laughs> okay, so now if we get a little cardio in, it's a jumping oblique twist. I don't know why I put jumping, because it's always jumping, but here we go. Hands one way, feet the other. Keep your feet together. Obliques, stomach tight. Twist, twist, twist. That's one, guys. Arms up high, loose up those triceps. Swing them. That's the way. See the outside of your shoes each time you jump. Twist. Good job. That's the way. Keep going. Get that heart right up. And then we go to a kneel. To a power knee. So that one, put a little padding on your mat, extra padding, because you are kneeling down. Nice job. Okay. I have carpeting in the mat, so I think I have plenty. Standing, you're going to kneel down, kneel, kneel. Foot comes up, make sure your knee is in line with your toe. 
power up that knee, down, down, up, power up that knee, down, down, up, stay in line, work on good alignment here, so you're not putting too much strain on your knees. right down to the floor. I'm, I know you'll be feeling your glutes tomorrow after this one, because I already feel mine from doing the workout last night, and I don't do the whole thing. I do pretty much half, but they go twice through. So it's like no one time. All right, so we are at 13, back bow to a toe crunch. So here we're working our back. Up, legs and arms, roll on over, and do a V up, and down. Use your abs to roll over, arch the back. Meet your feet in the middle. Exhale, you hear me breathing. It's good not to hold your breath. Don't push that muscle out. Breathe, don't hold it in. And over. And you can go the other way too. Down and up. And down and up. Roll it over. Let's do a spot. Excuse me, one more. Nice. Okay, so now we're doing a curl to a fly. So, I would say go with your heavier weights. Bicep curl to a fly, we'll go on one leg. So balance, bicep curl, bring them down, and fly. So keep a slight bend in your arms, palms up, palms come down, and then you go straight up. So palms are facing the floor as you raise up with your fly. Exhale, good job. A few more. One more, switch, curl, Woo. and lift, and curl, and lift. That's right, guys. Slight bend in your leg. You're, you're bending over, you're hinging over. So you're not totally straight, standing straight up. That's why. Five, three, two, all right, so now we go to, oh, I thought I had another push-up in there. Hope I don't forget anything. Okay, so now we have high knees, four, but hip four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Nice and high. And then kick the butt. Loosen up those hamstrings. It's going to be tight. One, two, three, four. Nice and high. Really overemphasize that knee up. One, two, three, four. that bent knee side and up. Watch your form. Good job, guys. A few more. Oh, 
one more. Okay, so this one is your lateral slide times four with a push up. So, lateral slide burpee. Here we go. One, two, three, four, and do your push up. Jump in. One, two, three. It's four, but I don't have the room. If I want to do a nice big lateral slide. And this way, guys. Good push up. string and your glutes. Come on, concentrate, Lori. Get it done. Up. That's the way. One more. Nice. Okay. So really, we are finished. Session complete. Good job, guys. So you got in a 20-minute workout with me. Unless you're doing this over again. So uh, if you are, nice going. Keep working hard. Work those muscles. Breathe. Get that heart rate up. It's all in your intensity. You can do this workout and just go really slow and not get your heart rate up. You're working your muscles, but you need to get the heart rate up. You're, you're pump up the metabolism. You burn calories. You're getting stronger. The more you can handle with your heart rate, the more you can do and the stronger you're going to get. So work hard. Nice job today. Make sure you stretch. Tighten your fuel. I'll see you next time. Take care.